Hi doctors, this is Dr. Fennell here. I'm on the beach still enjoying myself. It's a beautiful day today. And I wanted to uh, address something here. I just as a, as a cautionary statement to some of you DCs out there that may be thinking about starting a hand and foot clinic. I found that uh, there's been you know a handful of cases where DCs will take my first initial workshop and become really excited about opening up a hand and foot clinic because of the success that I had in my practice with focusing on hands and feet and really making my clinic a chiropractic hand and foot clinic. I will caution you. I've seen doctors, uh, of course in my program I've got doctors wanting to do that and that's fine. I'm helping them and helping them to tailor that program inside their offices so they can do it successfully. I caution you if you take one extremity course or two extremity courses and decide you're going to get rid of your sign, put a new sign up saying Dr. Smith hand and foot clinic, you know, because you're setting yourself up for possible failure. And the reason is, when you start having chiropractors saying, wow, what's this guy doing? And they send their wives in and themselves in for hand and foot care, they better notice something extremely superior that you're delivering to their hands and feet compared to what they could do themselves or other DCs could do for them on their hands and feet. So if you're not yet at that level, I'd caution you to think twice about doing so because number one, it's going to be an expense to change your signage and, and your branding of your clinic. Number two, if you cannot deliver the goods, you will not succeed. You know, so I highly encourage you to reconsider. I, there are some docs that took you know just one workshop and said they're going to rechange their whole clinic and put a new sign out saying hand and foot clinic, and that's great that they're excited like that. But you've got to make sure you can deliver the goods first. So. If you're interested in finding out more about having a hand and foot clinic, it's a great way to set yourself apart, apart from other chiropractors in your community and really receive referrals from DCs and medical doctors and companies. If you'd like to do that, I'm more than delighted to work with you on taking that step-by-step -step approach to really becoming the expert in your community and learning how to communicate it effectively to others in your town. Thank you.